Some allusion at the border to Aisha Hosni now on Capitol Hill, where both sides are presumably trying to iron out something to deal with this. But Aisha, I guess good luck on that front. What's the latest? <laughs> That's right. Hey there, Neil. Well, Democrats, first and foremost, aren't even united on whether the border is secure or not, but they are in total agreement that the border is a problem that needs to be fixed to the point that even progressive Representative Ro Khanna is now calling on the vice president to try to help Democrats strike a deal on immigration reform. Watch. Do you think she's doing a good job with the border? I think we need a better solution on comprehensive immigration reform. And so what I would say to the vice president is help lead to get comprehensive immigration reform done. So will she help lead to do that? Well, that's unclear because she and the president think the border is already secure, Neil. And it's contrary, obviously, to what Bill Malusian just reported. The countless images we show you every single day of thousands of migrants crossing into the southern border. Now, congressional Democrats are being forced to revisit this issue just seven weeks before Election Day because those mayors and governors of border towns are busing thousands of migrants to sanctuary cities. Now, Democrats would like to see a reformed immigration system that at the very least would include a guest worker program to help fill worker shortages across the country and at the very most offer a pathway to citizenship for undocumented migrants. Republican deal makers, though, say there will be no deal on immigration until the president secures the border. So now Democrats are talking about giving FEMA more money to help these migrants. FEMA is actually helping to take care of those migrants at the border and the migrants that are being bussed all over the country. And apparently, they want to add that to the government funding bill that is currently being negotiated in the Senate. The problem right now is that particular fund at FEMA is running low. And so we need to make sure there's more money in the continuing resolution for that. Uh, I'm working on that right now with others in leadership, and I hope that we're able to get that done. So are Republicans going to be all about that? Well, probably not. Senator Braun just told me they will likely not support more FEMA funding as long as the border remains unsecure. Neil? Aisha, thank you very much. Well, let's go to